Hello, darling people. It's um, Monday, March 8. So, self low self-esteem. Someone asked me about it, you know. Something that's so common, isn't it? It's, just, it's, actually, it's, it's utterly fascinating. But the, what's fascinating about it is, first of all, what, when we look at what it is, you know, you look in a mirror, and then what you do is you see the faults. You think about what you've achieved, and you see what you haven't achieved. You think about the things you've got, and you think about what you haven't got. And somehow we run to that very easily. No one taught us. So mummy didn't teach us this, you know. And, um, I mean, she might have reinforced it, but she didn't teach us. It's something that's instinctive in there. It's so fascinating, and it's a habit. It's clear. But the outrageous thing is we need to know why we believe it. It's a thought. A thought arises, and it becomes a feeling. But the tragedy is we believe it. And we know that 27 people can tell you, no, Rabini, you really look rather lovely. You know, you are, and you don't believe. We're hungry to hear it. This is the tragedy, but we don't believe it. And then one person says, I don't like your nose, Rabin, or you are fat. I, I agree with you. You're devastated. So it's kind of fascinating. So, yeah, we have it, which is habit. And forget about, you know, what, go into karma and explain all that. But never mind. The really powerful thing is we have to learn to not believe it. We have to learn to not to listen to all the crazy roommates, what the good roommates and the bad roommates in our crazy head, okay? And for some reason, the, the crazy ones loom large, but much more loud. You know, I've never met a person who says, oh, I can't stop thinking good thoughts all day. You know, we, somehow it's the irony of ego. But the key practice is to hear them and then actually stop and, and say to yourself, I wonder if it's true. This is mind boggling. This is like putting atomic bombs under the ancient habits, you know, of the irony of ego, which is low self esteem, self hate. One time the, the Dalai Lama heard it about the, the suffering, in, especially in the West, and he said, This is a mental illness. We should, have, we should have such compassion for ourselves, but stop believing it. And then you, it doesn't work overnight, but slowly, slowly, you start to change the script in your own head, you know? Absolutely. Do it every day.